At one point, uh, Putin made a very rapid uh, turn around the table and shook everybody's hand, uh, mm. but without any exchange of names. So that's about as significant as this was. Well, that you know, sounds I was like in collusion Moscow. to me. So wait, can, they, can, can, can we get exactly. to your real crime, which was running for president as a third party candidate? And in the view of mm -hmm. a lot of people in Washington, you got Donald Trump elected. Do you see this as punishment for the crime of running for um, president? Uh, yes. Uh, yes. I mean, in many ways, many of the articles like the New York Times three days ago in announcing this investigation began with a quote from a former spokesperson for the Clinton campaign saying that, well, isn't this great because so many um, Clinton Democrats are furious at me. They're outraged that yeah. I dared, in so many words, you know, dared to think that we get to make up our own minds, that our votes don't belong to Hillary Clinton or to anybody else. But I got to say, you know, it's not just Democrats. This is a bipartisan commission oh, that's know. led by Republicans. I'm aware. And yeah, yeah, they, they have it in as well because it's very inconvenient to have a, you know, uh, an opposition uh, political party that's but, not but, taking but if they, orders if from they the disagree same with uh, you, Look, if they disagree with what you're saying, and for the record, I disagree with almost everything you say. But if you disagree <laughs> with what you say, why not argue against it? Why try to pretend that you're an agent of a foreign government? That seems like McCarthyism to me. Uh, you know, you're not the only person to suggest that. I think, you know, this is, you know, let me say, I think there are legitimate aims here um, in the investigation. I think an interference in our election is much bigger than the Russians, you know, and we have yet to see the proof. I would like to see the evidence of Russian culpability here.